Today we're going to be ripping this Charizard EX10. It's the Paldean Fates. Uh, I have another one over here if this first one doesn't go good. I don't open sealed product very often, um, so we'll see how this goes. But if I'm feeling uh, the itch, I will open another one. We're going to just set this... Uh, this is a cool promo. We're going to set this promo off to the side for now. And we're going to get into these packs. Let's see what kind of packs are in here. Move that over there. I think they're all Paldean Fates. Okay, perfect. So let's just jump into this. Let's see. Had a uh, little bit of a rough day. So I am rewarding myself by ripping some packs. And uh, obviously... We are going for the Gardevoir or the Charizard. Um, but at this point, I would take any decent pulls. Give me a go reverse. Annoying bat reverse. Okay. All right. Not a bad start to this tin. Nimona. Nice. Okay. I do not have. I do not have my sleeves handy. I was not prepared. But I will sleeve those. Don't worry. I did, um, there was some talk online, uh, about the time I picked, um, these boxes up that, um, some of these boxes were loaded. So we will see. People were, people were pulling, uh, Charizards out of them. But, uh, that's a batching thing. Like, I don't know. I don't know how often that actually happens like that. Ooh, shiny oddish, nice. Okay, that is the Denny into a Mag Mortar. Okay, so we will keep our hits if I can be gentle with them over there. Paladin Fates is a fun set. Let me know if you guys enjoy ripping the set. I like all the shinies and stuff, so it makes it fun to open. And I've barely opened any, to be honest, but. Barely opened any packs in a long time, so this always is fun. Barboach, Lechonk, Umzakot, Scrafty, Swoobat, Rare Candy, Ractus, Executor. That's cool artwork. I like that for a standard rare, standard hollow. All right. I feel like this box is dead because of that Nimona pull. <laughs> and that's okay. I'll take that any day. Sometimes it sucks when you get some of these like lower end products, um, like the boxes or the tins that you just strike out on completely. Oh, there's the Executor in reverse. And Armor Rouge. So, you know, that, that, can, that can be uh, unfortunate. All right, last pack. Last pack magic here. Let's see what we can do. I don't know. Might have seen that we might have gotten skunked here. But that is okay. That is why we brought back up Oinkalone, Artisan, Ghastly. Oh, not a very valuable card, but nice. Bug Trio. And the Houndstone. That is still super cool to pull. Pulling cards of any type is always fun. All right. We're going to do another one. You guys are just going to have to bear with me, please, for one second, because I cut this box open. Hold, please. Okay. Got our tin out of the way. So, how many packs are in here? One, two, three, four, five. So we got three hits out of five packs. So that's not bad, really. And uh, the promo cards, the promo card is cool. Let me know what you guys think of that Charizard promo. I think it's pretty nice. All right, energy, 
Grievard, Chinchow, Woobat, Scraggy, Iono, Kilowattrel, Clive, Scraggy. Oh, Reverum. All right, all right. Come on. Give me a big pull. These were, um, there was still quite a few uh, tins left on the shelf um, when I got these. Um, but these were, I think, the only Charizard ones. So, I like that Pikachu artwork. Probably, ooh, Smoliv. Okay, nice. We will take that. Put that over there. Annihilate. And Reverum again. I just never get to open packs anymore, so this is a treat. Energy, Mankey, Flittle, Pikachu, Grievard, TM, Dashbun, Nimone is back. Oh, that's a cool Charmeleon. I like that art. Reverum. Oh, we got a Charizard. Whoa, that's cool. I'll take that. Anytime you get to pull a Zard. That's pretty cool. Don't know what that's going for currently. We'll put that guy over here. Nice. Okay. That's cool. I don't I don't remember normally seeing um that style being textured, so that's cool. I don't know. I don't know how valuable that is. I'll, I'll have to take a look. Like I'm set I'm not um I'm not super up to date with the values of the cards on this set besides like the uh, Charizard and the uh, Gardevoir. Oh, Alakazam. Nice. Wow. That is a nice pull. Guys, don't hate me for not having sleeves. I'll get them sleeved, I promise. Okay. I might have, I have them in here somewhere. I just don't know where they are. All right, last pack. A pretty, pretty stacked, uh, pretty decent little tins, honestly. I think they're a little bit more expensive than the normal tins. Can't remember what I paid for them. But, Famfi, Chinchow, Varum. Oh. Is there texture back there? Is that texture? I don't know, I couldn't tell. Sometimes the regular hollows can get you through the... But, nope. It was just the corner. All right. And I told myself I wasn't going to do this. But I have this Ultra Ball I picked up as well. And we're going to rip it. Um, I don't even remember what's in these, to be completely honest. But, we're just going to do it. I think it's just three packs. But I think, uh, I don't think it's Revolving Skies. I think there's some Lost Origin, Fusion Strike, I think, or Silver Tempest. All right, these packs are mangled. All right, two Lost Origin, one Silver Tempest. Oh, man. Could you imagine? Could you imagine going, even getting, even getting one, one of the chase, chases, but could you imagine going Lugia Giratina? Alright. Uh, what is this? Four? Four is the pack trick on these? Alright. Here we go. Probably get hosed on these ones. But those tins were not bad. Let me know in the comments what you guys think, think about those tins. I think that's just kind of Paldean Fates. It's just a fun set to open. I like the sets that have a lot of hits. A lot of cards in them. Halucha Reverse. And, oh, okay. Alright. Lost Origin. Man. Lost Origin. Are you going to do us dirty? Or are you going to give us something? Probably. Ooh, that's cool gloom. Probably going to do us dirty. But that is okay. Oh. All right. Knew I should have kept that sealed. <laughs> Last pack. It's okay. It can all all can be forgiven. I'll take the Aerodactyl. 
I'll take anything at this point, honestly. <laughs> Alright, any sort of hit. Oh, wait. Black code card? Does that mean hit? The other ones were white, right? Okay. Alright, we'll slow roll this last pack here. Cedra. Seviper. Stunfisk. Cute Growlithe. Oop, just lost a card. Ducklet. Rock Rough. Seal. Zorua. Okay. Alright. Nothing. <laughs> or Beetle. Dang. We got smoked. Alright, actually, I realized the sleeves were right next to me the whole time. So we'll just sleeve these up real quick, if I can be gentle and not scratch these. This is a nice, this Charizard with the texture looks a lot nicer than some of the other like uh, Z half art Zards, and it's not half art, but you guys know what I mean. Um, let's see, Nimona. Apologize for the delay. I am probably not going to edit this out. You guys can just watch it. And if you want to skip to the next video, feel free. I think the Wug Trio honestly is like a dollar card, but um, it's still cool to pull. Great looking card. Kind of a weird Pokemon. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, and I just. I'm not set up for this. My All those bulk cards just fell off. All right. So, in summary, good, nice look at these. Wug Trio, Shiny Smoliv, Shiny Oddish, Nimona, Charizard EX, cool looking card, and the Alakazam EX. So, I will definitely take it. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Don't really do videos like this often, but that was fun. Uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Remember, it was never a phase.